Um, so how long have you been diagnosed with your mental illnesses? Um, I've had depression and anxiety since I was uh, 13, and I was diagnosed with borderline personality disorder um, about a year ago now. My name is Jess. I have depression, anxiety, and borderline personality disorder. How do your mental illnesses affect you throughout your day-to-day -day life? Well, depression and anxiety makes it hard for me to do daily tasks and uh, just uh, really just lead a normal life. Um, it can be really crippling just doing, you know, normal things that everyone else finds easy, like getting out of bed, you know, brushing your teeth, getting a shower, going out, running errands, like going to work. So throughout my day, um, I never know, like, how I'm going to feel, and I'm very much influenced by my environment at all times. It is something um, most of my family members struggle with, um, and borderline personality disorder uh, mostly develops from trauma. Uh, however, there are like genetic um, components to it, but it's not really well researched. What are the symptoms of BPD? I mean, like, there's nine symptoms, so there. It's hard to um, remember them all. Can you tell us about your therapist? How long have you been seeing her? I've been seeing Heidi probably close to eight months now. I feel like that would be a ballpark. She's really great. She's the first therapist that I really had that um, was really willing to work with me, uh, especially with the borderline stuff because there is a lot of stigma around it. So. A lot of therapists don't want to work with BPD patients, but she's been really good. What are the th some of the things that you do to help you deal with your mental illnesses? Um, I've been notori notoriously bad at like coping mechanisms, so I don't have like a lot that I do outside of you know just taking that step to like get out of bed, seeing my friends. Uh, reading really helps me. Um, going for a walk, just like, you know, the little things, kind of. People with BPD are humans, and I know, like, saying it's a personality disorder, you know, kind of feels like it's who you are, but it's really, at the end of the day, a disorder that doesn't define you, and, uh, because a lot of people like to demonize people with borderline personality disorder. Um, the disorder can make you do awful things, but it really doesn't define the person.